Hey everyone, my name is Riley and in this video we are going to be comparing E-Rank to Everbee to see which of these is the best keyword research tool for Etsy. For both of these tools, I will leave links down in the description. Of course, there are affiliate links and anytime that you sign up for one of these tools, if you upgrade to one of the paid plans later down the line, then I will earn a small commission at no extra cost to you. Now, the first major difference between Everbee and e rank is fundamentally how they work. So with e rank, what we have to do is we come in here and everything that we can do, we do inside of the application. So if we do keyword research, if we do competitor research, we do this all inside e rank and we essentially find keywords on Etsy and plug them in right here. Whereas with Everbee, this works on Etsy. Essentially, if I go to extensions right here, you can see Everbee is a Chrome extension and this means that it works on Etsy. So you never have to leave the Etsy app. All of this is integrated. So in my opinion, this is the first pro of Everbee. The fact that you don't have to keep flicking around and using different applications. The second fundamental difference between Everbee and E-Rank is E-Rank is more of a jack of all trades. It can do more, but Etsy is specifically a keyword research tool. So it really comes down to what is better, the jack of all trades or the master of one. And I would say that Everbee in terms of keyword research is the absolute master and there is not really a better tool out there specifically for keyword research. So to show you why, if we first of all try out Everrank, right? And let's say we maybe want to go into the niche of gifts for dog lovers. So we can search that right here. And then of course we can see all of these listings on Etsy. And to use this inside of E-Rank, we need to go up here and copy the keyword. We can then come to E-Rank right here and go to the keyword research section. And then you can see we have the keyword tool. So we paste that in and then we can click on search. And in here, it's now going to load up all of this keyword data. So we can see things like the average monthly searches, the average clicks. So you will notice as well that the clicks is higher than the average searches. This usually comes from Etsy apps. We then have the click-through rate, which is 117%, and we can see the competition for this keyword. We can also see the search trends. We can see that this has remained around the same over the past year. In June 2023, we did 1,130, and last month we did about 1,200. So it's remaining relatively the same. We can also see where these searches came from by country. But most importantly, if we scroll down here, this is where we can see the keyword area. Now, I do not have full access to E-Rank right here. It's a keyword research tool that I used to use, so I know how to use it, I know how it works, and I know what is good and bad, but I left this tool for Everbee. But either way, we can see down here, these are all of the keywords. We can see things like the search trend, the average searches, the average clicks, and this is all of the information that we are going to be given. Now, let me compare this to Everbee. If we go over, once again, we don't even have to leave the app. So we just go to keyword research right here. And you will notice that we not only have keyword research, we have product analytics. And this is by far the most valuable tool on Everbee. E-Rank don't have anything like this. Like if we go to keyword research, we can't see any kind of analysis. And the reason that the product analysis is so good is because we can click in and we can see the monthly sales, we can see the price of the product, we can see the monthly revenue. And my favorite thing to do, the way that I always use Everbee, is to sort this by the top monthly revenue. And then from here, we can go down and we can start getting product ideas from what is selling well. So we could go down here and we can see pet name bracelet. So we might want to use this as a keyword idea. With E-Rank, we can kind of get keyword ideas from this area, but there's no way of really seeing how well they are doing or how well they are selling without using a tool like Everbee. So what we can now do is because we can see pet name bracelet, we can take a deeper dive into this. So this time I'm going to search for pet name bracelet, just like this. And then once again, we can go to product analytics sort by the top monthly revenue and look at these. These are all of the best selling products. So this is for the past month, estimated revenue in the last month. We can see these are all doing fantastic. So now what we might want to do is go over here to keyword research and once again, search for pet name bracelet. And then in here, we can see the volume, we can see the competition and they give us an overall keyword score. 
So the keyword score essentially derives from the amount of monthly volume divided by the volume. So in here, we could potentially look at things that have high volume, but low competition, like this keyword right here. So personal pet name bracelet, this might be a fantastic keyword to target. Now with just these two tools, this is essentially all I use for my Etsy keyword research. With eRank, as I say, in the keyword research section, they don't have as much that we can do. We can do things like comparing keywords in here where we can compare different keywords and see which ones have the highest volume, which ones have the best trends, but it just doesn't have the level of in-depth analysis where we can physically see the sales and the products like we can on Everbee. However, eRank does have this competitor analysis, this listing optimization and shop insights and things like this. And these are all things that Everbee doesn't have. So essentially we can go in here and if we go to listing optimization for like a health check as an example, it's essentially going to show us all of the products on our store and help us if we have missing tags, missing images, spelling issues or one word tags. It's going to flag them all here and we can go in and boost the health of our listings. We can also go to listing audits right here and this is overall just going to see the performance of each listing and tell you how to improve each of your listings. We then have competitor research, which if we go to as an example, competitor listings, it's going to scan your store and see which products you have and then find other stores that are in a similar niche and in a similar level of success. And they are going to show you their listings, what they are doing, how you can kind of copy and mold them and make your store even better. So overall, what I would say about both of these tools is you can use them both in conjunction. You can use Everbee right here to do some really deep product research. And then if you need some help with your listings, if you want to be researching competitors, if you need shop insights with traffic stats and tag reports and things like this, then you can use eRank as well. You can kind of combine these tools to get the power of both. However, if you just need one for keyword research, then Everbee is going to be by far the best option. The final thing that we are going to compare is going to be the pricing of both of these tools. And as you can see, the level of depth in the keyword research tool on Everbee really reflects in the price. Now, it's definitely not the most expensive software out there coming in at $20 per month, but it is more expensive than eRank that comes in at $6 per month for this basic plan. Now, essentially, if you are just getting started and you don't need to connect multiple shops, you don't need these advanced data features and you don't need these high daily quotas, then you are absolutely fine going with the basic plan. And this is the plan that I would recommend for most people. The same with Everbee, I just recommend sticking to this $20 per month plan if you do want to upgrade because most of these other things, you get a tag analyzer, which I personally don't use, unlimited favorite folders, unlimited store connections and priority chat. It's really not worth upgrading to these higher tier plans unless you are making a lot of money with your Etsy store. So that is my comparison of Everbee versus eRank. If you found this video valuable, don't forget to smash that like button and tap that subscribe button. And until next time, take it easy.